What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with some more Bleach. Today we're doing episodes 34, 35, and 36. 33 is a filler. It's the only reason I'm skipping it. But we are continuing the Soul Society arc. I am super excited, but also nervous, especially after last episode with that amazing uh, Renji back, uh, backstory flashback with uh, Rukia. We must save her. We must do what we got to do. Remember to check out that Patreon if you guys want early access and the full length uncut versions of these reactions. Check out the Twitch, twitch.tv slash Darius. If you guys ever want to watch these live with us, it always is a vibe. And if you guys don't mind, follow me on my other social medias, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, all at Dapper Darius. Much appreciated. I'm not going to waste any more time. Uh, let's hop right into it. Bleach, episode 34. All right, this is right where we left off with Renji swallowing a shame, asking Ichigo to save her. I can't, we won our battle against Renji. We really did. But Ichigo's also not looking too good so that's how i'm wondering how are we gonna fight these other lieutenants how are we gonna do the cap like Ooh. gotta get out of here we're gonna go back into the sewers where are we gonna go <laughs> zanpakuto is so heavy bleach episode 34 cool title card is that kira They are squad four, relief and aid. I forgot. Hey, okay, Hanataro can be super clutch right here. Okay, shout out you, Hanataro. One night, we're gonna be spending the night here. That's crazy. Byakuyo. There's no need? You don't want Renji to be healed? In prison? Uh huh. What's her name? Because I like how kind and considerate she is, and I like she's standing up for Renji. Hmm. She's a lieutenant as well, right? Oh, that's Hinamori. Yep. Of course, Ichimaru's here as well. Thank you, Ichimaru. I don't know if you're going to want to go against him, though. Then we got what's his name here too. It's Ugaya. Oh, he's also suspicious of Ichimaru. I did not know Kira was his lieutenant. I know Aizen is suspicious of Ichimaru. It's Ugaya was walking past when they were having this conversation. I wonder if he overheard. I appreciate the warning. See, I don't like this. All out war. We're just trying to save our girl, man. Give it a little time, buddy. It, Chad and Orihime and Ishida are in trouble, I won't lie. Ganju with the right call. Knock his ass out, make him sleep. Funny. Interesting. I didn't know we keep that inside our clothes. Is that what it hit? It hit the mask? It's our uh, Hollow Reaper mask. I don't really understand it either. I won't lie to you, but... Hmm. So even during Academy Days, Renji and Hinamori were, were friends, or at least trained together. I guess I like their school uniforms. Oh, 
Zach? Oh, wow. They all kind of trained and went to school together. Yamamoto. I gotta get all these names down. Permission to wear your swords and unleash your Zanpakuto at any time is kind of wild. Like, I'm curious what some of these stronger captains Zanpakuto's look like, you know? Is Hinamori the lieutenant of Aizen Squad? Speak of the devil. I assume, I assume so. So far, Aizen's a good dude. Questioning whether the execution of Rukia is even just and letting Hinamori come in. That's good. W captains, except Yakuya. I want to learn how to play guitar just so I can play this song. Isn't it such a soothing voice? I just want to hear that man read me poetry, you know. He's going to let her rest for a little. She did have a crazy night. Now, who would that be who's at the door as well? Oh, not going to tell me. I don't like that. I don't like the look of that. <laughs> she runs past the just destroyed courtyard after Renji and Ichigo's fight. Got some crazy hops to get up. There's no way that's Aizen. Who was standing outside of his door when he was talking to Hinamori? Who would kill a captain? That is such a shot, too, with the blood just straight leaked down. Oh. Nah, what the hell? Nah, there's no shot. There's genuinely no shot. Genuinely. All right, this is the next episode 35, right where we left off. There's genuinely no way. It had to have been someone that jumped him, because there's no way a captain could be defeated brazenly without people at least publicly seeing it. But who would have done that? The only person I can assume would be Ichimaru because of the suspicions he already had on Ichimaru. What the hell? That is a horrible wake-up call for... Not a, that's a horrible thing for Hinamori. I don't even know what I'm trying to say. That's insane. They better not think it's any of the Ryoka. They better not think it's any of us. Oh, hell no. See, you should genuinely be concerned, Ichimaru. Like, you're suspect number one, two, three, four, five, and six right now. Bro, if Ichimaru killed Aizen, nah, we gotta gang up and beat this boy down right now. I like that black and white shot of Hinamori's tears flowing in the wind, though. Oh, no hesitation, Hinamori W, Lieutenant. Kira stopped her. That is his captain. The fact that he genuinely doesn't care that one of his co-captains is dead or that this is a terrible situation and like makes this seem so suspicious. That's a crazy shot. Nah, we need a... Obi Yume. Oh, Zanpakuto is getting unleashed. Now I'm afraid Hinamori is going to be tried and executed. We need another captain's meeting right now to deal with this. I really like her Zanpakuto. There's no way. After we just got such a nice flashback of everyone being homies back in the day? Wabisuke!
Oh, Toshiro stopped him. It's Ugaya. Good man. He makes a valid point. Bro, the fact that you look like this is so just deranged. Captain of Squad 10. I did not know he was Squad 10. Is that why he stepped in? I mean, he would have been theoretically in his right to kill a lieutenant that's attacking him and in the open eye, you know? Bro, shit's getting crazy. This is getting deep, man. I thought it was going to be us versus hollows fighting monsters this whole show. This is getting crazy, man. As Chad wakes up, he also taking refuge in some sort of storage area. Oh, I love how it's like a coat over his arm. All right, right back to the courtyard we were just in. Hopefully we can make it to the tower this time. Oh, is this the pink kimono guy? He's one of the captains as well. Kyo, was that Kyoraku? Kyoraku? Oh, this is getting interesting. This is getting interesting. Is that spiritual pressure they're feeling? What is that? Is it Kenpachi? Whose is it? Oh, it's Kenpachi. I love the way they have him silhouetted in white like that. Oh, hell no. Alright, this is right where we left off. Feeling the Kenpachi spiritual pressure. Oh, great title card. In station special detention cell. Inamori and Kira, probably because they both got arrested. I feel bad for Hinamori, especially after just the nice little conversation we had with him last night. We were watching him do his little. What up, Rangi? You look amazing. Damn. Yeah, if it was Ichimaru, they would have gotten rid of it. Shout out Rangiku. Yeah, for sure. Hopefully it gives her some sort of closure. Or something. Because that is a shitty situation. Was he preparing for the possibility of, like, a backstab? Someone killing him? That's crazy. The truth. Some revelations, possibly? I like how she's entrusting it to Hinamori. Oh, they're not gonna tell us? And there's no shot. That's how you know it's something crazy. God damn it. Sound of the bell. Okay, one of the ones I've been wanting to see fight the most. A crazy visualization. I didn't realize those were bells on the tip of his of his hair spikes. I like that actually. Oh, this is the one Ikaku said look out for. Captain of Squad Eleven, Kenpachi Zaraki. What in the hell? Oh, did he not actually stab him? What in the Genjutsu? Can't 
Kenpachi Zaraki. His eye patch is so sick. I don't like the sound of that, genuinely. It's like the agents in Matrix, man. You just gotta get out of there. That's a good question, though. How do we run away? I don't know how this fight's gonna go. They can't even stand up. Respect it. Alright. Ichigo versus Kenpachi. Gonna give us a handicap like we're playing a fighting game. Kenpachi really is different. My neck, my gut, my eyeball. Okay. Oh, they're not even gonna show us the outcome of that. Really? You will never go down. What? What? Ask you guys to take care of Rukia. That's his number one goal here, even if it costs him his life. I respect both parties. Anataru and Ganju and Ichigo. Both are determined, you know? I like that. I like that. Let's do it. Hell yeah. I don't know how a fight with Kampachi is going to go, though. I won't lie to you. He's gonna grab his on Pacto? What? You can't cut Kenny? I would love to have that answered. He's just like a un terrible, unslashable wall of spiritual energy. He's disappointed. Let me get the rust off this thing. Oh my lord. Oh, 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 oh. All right. Um, when I say stuff is going crazy, like I said, I just was not expecting this arc to get this insane. Like, Aizen is dead. Hinamori is in prison. Kira is arrested. Ichimaru is being threatened by Toshiro. Kenpachi doesn't care about any of that. He just wants to fight Ichigo, who Ichigo can't even slay. I just don't know how this is gonna work out how are we gonna save rukia how are we gonna do any of this it's great power scaling to show us how we're not even close to the pinnacle of what we can be yet and uh we can definitely go a lot further but i just don't know how this is gonna work out i be honest with you like i said i knew there were certain characters like uh i've heard of certain characters i knew uh, this this that, and third but i did not i was always expecting them to take us in and be on the same side as we go fight hollows i did not expect us to be antagonistic towards each other so i have no idea how this is going to play out i'm hoping whatever uh aizen wrote to hinamori gets revealed i'm hoping i'm hoping ichimaru gets his head cut off i'm hoping kenpachi gets defeated I, like i said I, none of my hopes are probably going to come true but shit is really hitting the fan right now shout out rangiku for coming in clutch with hinamori shout out hanataru 
I don't know what to say, man. Like, it's getting crazy. Shout out Chad for the little flashback we got of him meeting Ichigo. We haven't, we, I don't think we saw Orihime and Ichigo this entire session. Like, maybe for like a split second. Like, we saw Yoroichi for like a split second as well. Like, what is going on? I want to see. Oh, and we got to have Chad go against what's his name? Chunsui Kyoraku. Kyora yeah. Like, oh no. Oh no, no, no. Who's voiced by Ubo Black Blackbeard Thor Kell's voice actor? Oh no. This is about to get crazy. Thoroughly enjoying Bleach. I'm very invested. Like I said, my entire schedule lined up right now of anime is insane. But uh Hopefully you guys enjoyed these episodes. If you did, please leave a like. Let me know your thoughts down below. Check out Patreon, early access, full length. Check out Twitch if you guys ever want to watch these live with us. Great vibes. Now we're going to drink some water. Tell someone you love them. Because you never know when you're going to walk into a courtyard and see them stabbed on a wall. Damn. RIP Eisen, man. Peace out, Apple Squad.